Welcome back guys on my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to introduce you to a new product. This product was sponsored and provided for free uh, by Kiko Tensely, which you see the link in the description. But I'm not here just to make a sponsored video. I really want to introduce you to a product that some of you may not know the existence of and that I find really useful if you find yourself having to clean very dirty parts of your engines and of your motorbike. This is a parts washer. But now let's look in the detail how it's made and then I'll show you how to use it. At the moment you can see the parts washer closed and even closed it's pretty useful because sometimes I use it like a small workbench but let's open it you just need to pull the cover and thanks to this mechanism with the spring it will keep the cover opened and let's look in the detail what's inside. The first thing you can see we've got a little basket and this basket is for small components so if we are cleaning bolts or very small things that we don't want to lose and have to search with our hands in the, in the special uh, liquid. Then we have a, a sort of shelf that is removable for bigger parts and if we want if we remove the basket and the shelf we will have 75 liter of uh, capacity of space so we will be able to clean not only motorbike components but even car components. Other than this we have here the nozzle which we can move around and it will stay in the position we place it in but in this case with the Kiko Tensely parts washer you get even uh, a brush this is very very useful because while the liquid is coming out and you're cleaning apart you can really scrape the dirt out of the parts. This is removable, so if you want to have only the nozzle, you can just pull out the tube. And to end with, we have here the pump that's making the liquid flow. And to activate it, we'll just need to press the switch on the side. And this, at least here in Italy, and in Europe, we have this type of electric connection. It's a normal 220 volts, so Anyone with a garage can use this type of product. Lastly, we have a lower shelf, which is handy when we want to put maybe the parts we washed and we don't know where to place them. We can put them here or put other detergents. And once we finished using the parts washer and we want to remove the dirty liquid, under here we have a bolt, we remove the bolt and all the liquid will drain out. But now let's see how it works. I'll pour in the liquid and show you how to just clean a normal engine part. A handy feature is the possibility to remove the cover of the pump. So one day if we have to substitute the pump because it's not working anymore or for any other reasons, we can do it ourselves. And also the possibility to remove the filter to clean it or change it. The parts washer can be used with many different liquids and even just with water and soap. But in this case, I got also the specific liquid used to degrease components, motorbike and engine components. And now we'll pour it in and then start washing. We're now ready to start activating the pump. The liquid is inside and also our parts. I've got here a cylinder head and a cylinder from a 125cc. We're gonna try and make them nice and shiny. This was a little demonstration and I just took like 30 seconds washing the parts, the cylinder head and the cylinder, and you can already see the difference. For sure, if I spent more time, I could get them even more clean. But this is why it's important to use this parts washer with the specific liquid so that you can obtain really good results. I really hope you enjoyed the video and that maybe I made you discover a new product or if you already knew about the parts washer, you finally seen it in action and what's it capable of. If you might be interested in this product or other tools, you can connect to kikutensily.it, I'll link it in the description. 
please subscribe to the channel and leave a like as this really helps me a lot. And I have to thank Kiko Tensley for providing me this parts washer, which I'll definitely use a lot here in the workshop. I guess it's all for today. See you in the next one. Bye.